Okay, I'm at uh, Khan Academy here, and I'm going to go to that web page. And I'm going to show you how you would assign uh, an assignment in Khan Academy. So get off of here. Uh, we're going to log in. Okay, so my email, cool email here, uh, and my password. That's going to log me in. <clears throat> so I have a bunch of classes in here. I have one kind of fake class. This is, uh, not a real class. I have some other teachers and administrators in here. So um, see some scores right off uh, from an assignment. So let's say I wanted to assign something to this class. Okay, so. I would click on assign. And then um, one of the things I need to do, actually, let me go through setting up a, a class here while I'm at it. So um, go back to my teacher dashboard here. And I'm going to actually create a new class from scratch. OK. Um, I'm going to call this uh, Tim's Really Fake Class. Uh, and I'm going to import some students from Google Classroom. Okay. I would click on Import, and then I'm going to select the class that I want to import them from. Now I'm, uh, this Computer Classroom Help is a classroom set up for a few teachers and administrators, so I'm going to import them from there. To do its thing. Uh, okay, and they sign in through Khan Academy with Google. Sure. Now we want to add some courses from a new class. So um, let's do Algebra 2. Okay, and we could pick, we could pick multiple ones. Let's do Algebra 2, Algebra 1, and let's do some trig. Throw some of that in there. Okay. Okay. Um, Want to add SAT? Sure. Okay. All right, class created. All right, so now we have that class created. So let's close this up. Okay, so now I'm going to go down to that class. Oh, and I called it Computer Classroom Help. All right. Um, all right, so we have these students in here. These are other teachers. Okay, so now I want to assign some stuff. So I'm going to go click on assignments, click on assign. And we can choose what we want to assign it from. Let's do Algebra 1. Okay, Algebra Foundation. So I'm going to click on that. That'll open up uh, different various lessons. Let's look at the overview of Algebra. Uh, we don't have any, we have videos, we could assign videos, but I don't want to assign an actual lesson. Let's look at introduction to variables. And we have evaluating expressions with one variable. So, okay, I'm not sure I want to assign this yet to my classes, but let's take a look and see if I would want to. Okay, so now this is a teacher overview. Uh, so students are going to do you know, seven of these 20 questions. All right. I want to look at the student view, see, see it a little closer, see what they're going to do. OK, so it says evaluate c minus 2 when c equals 7. Well, 7 minus 2, that would be 5. Oh, I'm going to go there. Look at that. Got it right. It's pretty sweet. Um, I'm going to evaluate 15 divided by k when k is 3. Well, 15 divided by 3, that's going to be 5. OK, uh, next one. Uh, 6 plus x when x equals 3, so that's 9. Okay, so I'm seeing, yeah, this looks like a good assignment to assign my class. Okay, so I'm going to actually move my cursor out here and just hit that, and that'll bring me out of that. Okay, but I want to do this assignment, so I'm going to assign it. Okay, 
and um, I'm going to pick a, a due date. So I'm signing it on a Friday. They're going to do it on Monday, though. So I don't want to do it on a Saturday. So I want to go down here to Monday, uh, no, Monday, March 23rd. I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to assign it to all the students in my class. Okay. And I'm going to click assign. Now, the students would have to go off and do this for me to see it. So, um, Obviously, with the course of this video, they're not gonna. We're not gonna have time to wait till Monday. That would be a long video. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna go to this other fake class I had, which was testing out calculus. Okay. Um, now here, I actually do have some scores. Okay, so I can take a look and I can see see that Mr. Mosher, Mr. Marchant didn't complete it. Mr. Libera, Ms. Cavanaugh did. So I'll give them, I usually give my students, uh, if they get three out of four correct, I give them full credit. Uh, so I will give these full credit, and my other students, I will give zeros. Um, for the time being. But you can grade it however you want. If you give them some partial credit for being late, it will tell you. Um, you can actually see on the assignment, too, I believe. Actually, let's, when you go to manage, you go to manage. Uh, you can view the report, and uh, that's not what I want, sorry. Uh, well, the view might be different. Let me check. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, I can click on this, two out, of the, two out of five, and then I can see exactly when they completed it. So did they complete it by the due date? Yes, these two did. So they will definitely get full credit. These did not because it was, oh, no, it's due today at 11.59. So they still have a chance. Anyways, do it however you want, but that's how you assign an assignment in con. Um, I hope this video is helpful. And if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks for watching.